Goose return to tie fight. Now, if you can knock knock one of those fighters out, you will win 100,000 baht. So, yeah, Patrick, we just saw it happen in the last it event. Did. It is possible, and we've seen Challenge John get knocked out with tie fight before, also. So, a no. lot of different factors in the mix here in this fight. Yeah, but so Borowski Best is uh, fighting out of Sitson Pinong in Phuket. Very well renowned gym. Started training when he was 16 years old, 10 years in the game. And this is, it was telling me earlier that his favorite part of Muay Thai is the clinch game, which is very unusual for foreigners. Very, very unusual for Thai fight as they don't really allow clinching. Right low kick there from Chanachon. Yeah, as you mentioned, the four avatars, Aaron Kitty is the new avatar because Sensatarn, who was an avatar previously, right. got knocked out by Sasha Moisa at the last event. Sasha Moisa somewhere swimming in money like Scrooge <laughs> McDuck. Chanachon moving oh, in, throws down. Throw from Chanachon. Patrick gets up, doesn't seem phased by it. Both fighters looking to utilize the left jab. Good hands there from Patrick. John John moving in with an elbow. Stiff left hand, stiff left hand of his own from Patrick. Oh, and a good right elbow from the pole. John John seems to be struggling with the distance right now, Adam. 181 centimeters tall is Patrick borowski and Not just tall, but you can see long limbed as well. And I think that's what it is. It's the long arms of Patrick. As you know, Chanajan reminds me of like the Adesanya oh. of Thai fight. He, he's so good at sort of figuring oh. out what his opponent is doing and then reading and reacting and adapting to it. Yeah, and he seems like he's got a real puzzle right now in uh, Patrick borowski Beska. The outside kick there from the Thai fighter. Buckling Patrick. Lead left hook misses the mark. Chanajan looking for that up elbow. It's been a really good start to this fight for Patrick. Yeah, he's done tremendously well. Overhand right there. Sure, just looking at the forehead of Chanajan. Looks like he might be cut, you know. Difficult to tell from here. Another crafty takedown from Chanajan. Maybe he's just got a vicious sunburn like me. <laughs> Possibly. No, no cut. What was that? That gum shield coming out? Yeah, just clean just that off. Sprinkle some water on it. Chuck it back in there. Good enough. The, real, the only really significant strike I've seen from Chanadron so far is with that low leg kick, and I haven't seen him see, throw well, it again. Well, he has had a couple of nice throws. I'd like to see him utilize that leg kick again, because I really think it was causing Patrick problems. End of round one. Very interesting. That was cool. Very competitive opening round there from uh, Chana John and Patrick Borowski Beska. Not an easy one to call. If I was going to put my neck on the line, I, you know, I think Patrick may have just nicked it. What do you think, Adam? Honestly, I'd agree with you. I mean, Patrick was pushing the action for most of that first round. He was moving forward a lot of the round. And Chana John spent with his back on the ropes. He did have a couple of nice throws, but that forward pressure and striking from Patrick, I think, might have stolen him that round. So, very interesting start. But as I mentioned, Chana John's so good at changing his strategy as he goes along. It oh! Kicks in the face there. So we'll you, see Adam, what happens. It's all about the length of the limbs that are causing problems to Chana John. The aggressiveness as well. I think Chana John's got to be what you just said. He's got to be more aggressive. He's got to go first. I don't want to sound like Dominic Cruz over here, but he's got to be first. Chana John's right eye looks like he might be closing, you know. Oh, there's that leg kick again. Yeah, he's definitely got some swelling underneath that right eye. Oh, and a left elbow from Patrick to that eye. This is a great job, a tremendous job from Patrick, in fact. Yeah, I'm not sure if we've seen China John in a fight this competitive since he fought Sayo. Very true, Adam, very true. Again, Patrick moving forward, good left kick to the body. China John, again, not throwing that leg kick that I think would help. I think it'd set up a lot more. Overhand right from Chanachon. 
looking for that that right high kick that knocked out Sayok. He might have to call this Polish fighter Patrick the Puzzle. Indeed. Because he really is posing problems for Chana John. Oh, he walks into that right hand, but he stayed, manages to stay on his feet. Yeah, you can see a big smile on the face. That usually means it hurt. Again, all work being done from Patrick. Chana John having to work off the back foot. Left jab, Chana John. They're not looking for that low kick, which does surprise me. Chana John looking for a step in knee, but again, the length, the range of There's Patrick is technique. causing problems. That's the technique you wanted Chana John to throw. Patrick just threw it, outside leg kick. Right hand to the body, that took from Patrick. I mean, again, look what Chana John is, back in the corner. From the forward pressure of Patrick. And it's not the kind of forward pressure you see in a desperate bid to come back at the end of a fight. It's just constant pressure from Patrick. A lot of blood. Yeah, it's coming from the nose of Patrick. It might be broken out of from that shot that we saw earlier. There's that low kick. That might make things interesting here. Trying to do oh, something like that. Left Unbelievable. Hand. Flash knockout. I'm not sure if China John's gonna be able to come back from that. He's trying to reel his senses back in, but he's in all kinds oh. of trouble and he's saved by the bell. Unbelievable drama here yeah. in Kelsey. Story of the fight so far. Patrick Borowski Beska is stealing one over a tie fight. Champion in Chanatron. I want to see that knockdown again, Adam. I thought, at the moment there, I thought Chanatron was out for sure. There it is, that left hook that floors Chanatron as he goes down. He was absolutely out. He literally landed face Boom. first on the canvas. He was out. And he got back up, but he really wasn't with it. And then the bell came. Unbelievable. When we went off air, Aaron, you said to me, the curse of the Avatar, is it real? Is this a real thing? It's like being on the cover of Madden. This is unbelievable. It, and it's different as well because when we saw Sensitarn got knocked out by Sasha Moisa, I mean, it was right in like the middle of the first round. It was, I don't want to call it a lucky punch because it wasn't because Sasha Moisa is an awesome fighter. But it was like a one strike kind of thing, you know? This is like Patrick's been winning this fight since the opening bell. Yeah, He's won Jana two rounds. Chana John needs a knockout. Chana John needs a knockout to win this fight. And I'm not even sure he's recovered from the end of the second round. Patrick looks invigorated, looks ready to do the unthinkable. Take that 100,000 baht home with him. He is the most confident man in the world right now. He's got Donald Trump level confidence. <laughs> Donald John looking to knee to the body. He knows he's gonna have to knock him out. Yeah, he has, he has to. to be super aggressive, which isn't necessarily his style. Not to say oh, he can't oh, beautiful left elbow! And another! Patrick on wobbly feet! All kinds of trouble! Janet John in for the kill! Another right hand! Left elbow! Good defense there from Patrick! Patrick fighting on the deck of a ship in the middle of a storm. He's trying to keep his balance. Good left knees there from Janet John. Trying to work their elbows in those clinch. Are we watching the WWE? Is this scripted? This drama is too much, Aaron. My head's gonna explode. It's incredible action. Patrick looking for that jab. Trying to get those legs going. Chana John trying to regain some momentum, trying to get some energy back up so we can probably move in. Left kick to the body. This is as good as Chana John's looked in this entire fight. He's finally looking confident, moving forward, being aggressive. A bleak kick there from Chana John. He's looking for that left high kick. But it's not going to be enough if he wins this round. If he wins, I mean, oh. I don't know that for sure, but. No, Adam, you're right. It's not enough in my opinion. You knock down your opponent. You have to get back up. You have to knock him out. Good defensive work there from Patrick. Patrick is looking battered, but Chanajan needs to finish oh, it. Oh, another right, right hand. hand. Chasing Patrick down. Right knee to the body. Another right hand there from Chanajan. Exciting stuff here at Tide Fight. Unbelievable drama. Patrick's face is honey. Chanajan's the bear. He's mauling him. 
He's got to go after him with that elbow, surely, Adam. Patrick does look tired now, look at him. But he's not running away, he's ready to die on the shield, like a warrior. Both of them. Right hand there from Janet Joe once again. And again with that right kick to the body. It's a race against time at this point. Well put, another right hand. And again, Patrick ties him up. Good work there from the pole. Looks like he's already fighting the night. Oh, beautiful outside thigh kick from Janet John. That's that kick you were calling for I him did, to throw earlier in the fight. It's too late now. We're just moments away from this fight ending. I think Janet John's going to lose, even though he's battered Patrick in this round. And but that's it. Of the third and final round. What are the judges going to do? I think that Patrick oh, won that fight, I, Aaron. I think you have to give it to him. But I'm not a judge, so I don't know, but honestly, based on the knockdown, you'd have to give it to Patrick. However, how do you judge that first round? If they give, yeah, I mean, if they give Chana John the first round, and they give him the third round, and then they give Patrick a 10-8, what is that, a draw? That's a draw. That would be a draw, but yeah, it looks like it's all about that opening round. Which I think Patrick won first. I do as well. We've been wrong before. And this is a pride rules as well. It's not like the last round is way more. So based on that rules, I'm giving it to Patrick. No matter who wins and loses in this fight, the crowd has won, the audience has won, the viewers at home have won. And the art of Muay Thai has won. It's beautiful. Thank you. Well, here we go. ผมหน้าผมแบบนั้นอ่าตั้งใจฟังกันดีๆครับผมจะประกาศผลแล้วนะครับเดอะฟินเนอร์เอสผู้ชนะได้แก่ไปฮะเขาหรือดำเขาห